Hello and thank you all for coming today. My name is Jessica Lanchin and I am the Sustainability Coordinator for the City of Sioux Falls. Here to talk to you today about our leaf drop-off sites. So there are currently two sites open. The one is where I'm at here, which is just west of the Household Hazardous Waste Facility off of North Cliff Avenue. And then there's another one located at the fairgrounds. But we do also accept woody brush and yard waste at the landfill too. Uh, for the leaf drop-off sites, each load is $3. When you pull in, the attendant will, drop, will direct you over to the dump area. Uh, we ask that you don't dump any other trash at the dumping area, and if you do bring your leaves in plastic bags, please take them out of the plastic bag before you dump the leaves, and then take the bag with you, or you can give it to the attendant to dispose of. Uh, this year also is the first time that we will be accepting pumpkins uh, from November 1st to the end of the leaf drop-off, which is November 27th. And so you can bring your jack-o'-lanterns jack or your Halloween decorations, and they will also get composted. Uh, each site is open Monday through Saturday, 12 to 5, and I'm sorry, Monday through Saturday, uh, 9 to 5, and then Sat Sunday, 12 to 5. The sites will be open November 1st through the 27th, but they will be closed on Thanksgiving. Uh, the leaves will be turned into nutrient-rich compost that you can pick up for free at the landfill, and then the woody brush will be taken to a local ethanol plant and be burned for energy. So now for more on uh, fall cleanup, we'll bring Matt Tobias, our code enforcement manager, on. As Jessica said, I'm Matt Tobias, Code Enforcement Manager for the City of Sioux Falls. Um, we're asking our residents to take advantage of the nice weather. Um, the way it looks in the next two weeks forecast is going to be pretty nice. So we're going to ask our residents to take care, take advantage of the nice weather. Um, clean your yards up. Uh, the one thing, um, there is no ordinance against rake, uh, saying that you have to rake your leaves, but we're, we're telling people that it's, it's not an ordinance, there's not an ordinance out there, but we're highly recommending you do that. Um, the one thing we don't want to see is we don't want to see that people blow their leaves into the street or the gutter pan or rake them into the street or the gutter pan. Um, when you're cleaning your yard up, the big thing you could do to help the city out would be to clean that gutter pan. Um, we don't want to see a lot of um, leaves end up in our storm sewer system. That If they get in the street, there's a good chance they have to get in, this, in the storm sewer system. So um, take advantage of the nice weather, clean your yards up. The other thing is if you have a small branch pile, we want to see that branch pile removed too because from the code enforcement perspective, um, that branch pile can harbor rodents and whatnot throughout the winter time. So snow's on its way, but today we're going to focus on leaves. Um, we want to make sure that people go out and they help help each other out, work together with your neighbors. Um, if, there's, if there's a neighbor in need that needs a little help, help them out too. I mean, we want to see our, our yards get cleaned up. A lot of leaves have fallen so far. There's a lot more to go. Um, so just take advantage of the nice weather we have. The other thing is we do have crews that are out sweeping. Um, our sweepers are going to be out for the next couple weeks, weather permitting. Um, they're not going to be able to do the entire town. Uh, we're going to want to see, that's where, that's where the residents can help us out. If there's leaves that pile up in the gutter pan in front of their houses, they can help us out a lot by just cleaning those extra leaves out there. So sweepers are going to be out. If you want to know where the sweepers have been, where they're going to be, those maps are available on SiouxFalls.org. They're out there. They're updated on a daily basis, so those are out there. So just take advantage of the nice weather we're having and clean your yards up. 